Today I am going to show you how to get started with Google Collaboratory, or Google Colab, a web IDE for Python. I use this for Python workshops that I teach at my university. Colab is a Jupyter Notebook environment, which is one of my favorite ways to illustrate code, research, and formulas. It can be tough to set up an IDE locally, so it may make sense to initially start off with a web IDE, then move on to an IDE installed locally on your computer, like PyCharm or Visual Studio. To use Google Colab, you need to be signed into a Google account. I'm signed into my Google student account. Let's search for Google Colab. It should be the first result in your browser, colab.research.google.com. Let's click the link, and we're in. You'll see a box pop up with various options. You can check out research projects you've been working on recently, example notebooks put together by the Google team, GitHub, your Google Drive, or you can upload a notebook if you have one on file. Let's check out the welcome page. Let's run the first cell, which will output the seconds in a day. To do this, just hit Shift Enter. You might notice that unlike other IDEs, a notebook can print out a variable without explicitly writing print. You can do this with just a single variable, but I found it does save time if you're running multiple calculations. If we scroll down further, we'll see that the Google team outlined a bunch of use cases for notebooks, data, science, machine learning, and more. You might notice that for the data science tab, we have libraries that are imported. Google Colab has a bunch of pre-installed libraries that you don't have to worry about downloading. However, it is relatively easy to download a library if need be. So the way that we do this is pip install with an exclamation point at the beginning. Even though NumPy is already installed, I'll use it as an example for this. And as it's loading the library, you'll see it down here. Finally, let me show you how to upload a notebook into Google Colab. In my workshops, I provide pre-filled notebooks so students can follow along. Simply go to File, Upload Notebook, and drag and drop. Great, so our notebook looks like it loaded in correctly. Finally, one thing I usually provide alongside with the notebook is data that we'll work with. It's easy to also upload this into the notebook that you're currently working with. Simply hit the folder and drag and drop the file into the bottom left corner here. And you'll see it loads and we are good to go. I encourage you to explore Google Colab a bit more if you're new and feel free to connect if you have any questions. You can leave comments on and questions on YouTube if you have any questions or you connect, can connect with me on LinkedIn, Twitter, or GitHub. Happy to answer uh, your questions if I'm able to. Happy coding!